Fearlessness is not, the, is not living without fear. It's the mindset which allows you to turn fear into strength. It's fear which fuels our ability to change, to grow, and to love. Originally, the fear of extinction was our sole motivator as beings on Earth. But as we advanced, we now fear things like professional complacency and digital or technological ineptitude. But those evolutions merely make it easier to watch any movie ever made on the internet or climb the professional ladder to a coveted executiveship. But what has truly allowed our spirits to evolve, to evolve is fearless love. Many of you over the following months will find yourselves at the threshold of a new chapter in your life, and fear may creep into your mind. The problem with the unknown is we do not know what lies within the shadows of our future. But even more present in those moments is the fear that we don't know what will become of us once we're traversing that unknown territory. Fear can often become a barrier holding us back from exploring that vast unknown. Fearless love is the key to turning that barrier into a portal. My remedy is to love fearlessly. Practice the fearless love of self and whatever those experiences bring a fearless love of self will allow you to accept changes as growth and failures as lessons learned. Fearless love exists throughout our history, and I know I would not be before you today without the fearless love of generations before me. The fearless love of others allows us to follow our heart, embrace and accept love in all its forms, even when that love puts us in the crosshairs of society. The fearless love of life allowed my father's ancestors to survive the most heinous, dehumanizing, and impactful system of slavery and displacement in human history. Research shows us that somewhere between 14 and 40% of all captives died in transit before even reaching the shores of the Americas. Only a fearless love of living can persevere near genocide. The fearless love of learning exhibited by students like the Little Rock Nine allowed me to attend an independent boarding school, much like Brooks, attend and graduate from an acclaimed university. For those of you preparing to embark into the unknown, whether it be a new job, a new school, or a new role here at Brooks, do so filled with fearless love. Remember that that love which has guided you to this point will be the propeller which carries you through your future. We let fear prohibit us from doing the small things, like not saying something you feel is true or biting your tongue when you see or hear something that you know is wrong. As the weather begins to change, allegedly, our days get longer and we emerge from our winter hibernations, take the time to be intentional about expressing and accepting the love that surrounds us all. The point of life is not to live without fear, but to learn how to grow a fearless love for the unknown. Don't sell yourself short by saying no to fear. Challenge yourself to be the best you can by looking fear in the face and saying not today. Pay attention during your time at Brooks and you'll see that that fearlessness already exists inside all of you. So take a chance, take a risk, and love fearlessly.